Hey guys, today I'm going to show you all what happens when talcum powder comes in contact with fire. Well, even I haven't tried this out, so let's see how it goes. Well, this is the talcum powder. I'll just pour some into this little container here. Alright. Well, I guess that much should be enough. Now. Well, I'm putting this deodorant inside so that it catches fire easily. Well, as you can see, I've put quite a lot of it inside. Now, all I gotta do is use the light over here and let's see what happens. You guys can see the fire. I'm not quite sure it's visible on camera. Well, it is burning. If you don't believe me, you can see this. Well, I'm not quite sure it's visible on the camera, but yes, it is burning. If you don't, yep, you can even see the plastic melting over there. Don't want to get the camera too close. You can see the shape of the plastic. Oh, well, that's quite bad. I think it's time we put out the fire. Wow, it's not going. Yep, that's it. It's extinguished. Now, okay, I think it's too hot for me to hold it. Uh, yep, no, yep, it is. I'm just gonna pour out all the powder. Let's see how it is. Hot time, it's hot. Wow. Well, as you can see the powder is just as how it was before except I don't know why a few crystalline blocks have formed well but overall it's amorphous just like how it was initially let's see that big block there oh yep it's just like before so I guess by this video we can conclude that fire does not have any effect on talcum powder. Anyway, we can just try it once more without the container. Well, it's again quite a lot of that's my lighter. Oh, there you can see the fire, right? Yep. Oh, there you can observe a slight change in color.
well this time you can observe a slight change in color of Yeah, but overall it's the same, just the surface gets a little black. Yeah. There's not much difference between the initial and the final part. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. If you like the video, please click on like and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you.